he is the master of all frogs, and his name is Frogs Master 595. Frogs Master 595. Frogs Master 595. Frogs Master 595. Why, hello everyone, this is Frogs Master 595. Guess what? It's finally time for the reviews again. Oh boy, it's been about eight months without this, I know. It really has been about eight months, I'm not joking. I keep thinking there's got to be some other review that happened after eight months, but really, there's not been any. It has been eight months since a review. Really, I mean, maybe you can find one, but I can't. So, yeah, it's another review. Would you, would you look at that? And look, it's a new series, too. Last time it was Dancing Hamsters. And, uh, and there's definitely more of those to review now. Uh, yeah. But, uh, we're gonna do the Beagle Mania Beagles. Yes, or Beagles, or The Beagles Beagle Mania review. Yeah, that that's gonna be a bit confusing of what the title will be. It, it's probably gonna be The Beagles Beagle Mania review number one. When I'm 64, because that's who this is, and we're gonna start reviewing him now. And of course, it's the four classic things that all the, um, I don't know, classic people remember. Classic collectors, not really, because, you know, I started these review things not too long ago. It's not like it's been two years of it. Yeah, it's not been two years. Not till January of 2019, really, if you didn't know that. Maybe December. Hmm, no, well, January. But when I'm 64, yeah. Beagle, Beagle Mania. Okay, I'm, I'm done with that joke that I did in that other video. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Uh, but, alright, so let's get started. So, his overall looks, okay? Okay, l let me just tell you about his overall looks. Alright, let's get started with that. I love the way he looks. I love it. I mean, this beige color with that shirt, you cannot and i know that none of you can tell me or show me or just put in the comments you cannot find a better color for this guy with this shirt no way this color is beautiful for his shirt and his shirt's really good too but the color is just even better because it complements the shirt and the shirt complements the color too i guess you know but more on the color complementing the shirt, because this color is just perfect. Um, ears are always good. These glasses, I like more than the frog when I'm 64's glasses. Really, I do. Like, I, I like them quite more. Um, you know, got the normal nose and tongue and stuff like that. I like how his is a bit longer. Yeah, pretty silly. You know, normal buttons, those look uh, good on the shirt. Uh, Walker, it's exactly like the frogs. Um, I think it was placed in this one better. Uh, I know that his arms aren't actually like holding it as good, but I think this one is still just placed better. Um, so yeah. And you know, he's got some white here and his skin cover in the back with his tail. And the white looks good with his beige, but all the beagles have white on him somewhere, you know? So for the overall looks, I mean... You know, I mean, I think you know what I'm going to say. And his battery compartment is obviously tan. And, you know, the button. He got a little bit of wear, but I don't know if, I don't know if that really counts as the looks. And it, when this should really be more as, like, wear for the next thing. But for overall looks, 10 out of 10. Because this is just beautiful. Okay? So, yeah. Alright, so. Here we go. It's time for rip stains, tears, holes, yada, 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 yada. Okay, so really, there's not that much. Um, the Beagles were pretty put together, I think. They were, their their skin was really well put together. I, like, never see problems. They're, they're always good, really. The ears, they're on pretty tight, actually. Um, you know, some are more tight than others. His are actually more loose, but still, it's tight. These glasses are actually pretty tight. Tight on. Tighter than, well, when I'm 64, the frogs. Uh, I mean, there's no holes on this. Uh, you know? 
not really anything. His button is a little bit wary, like just a little bit though. So I'm not gonna count anything off of it. And besides, most of that was, you know, from when I press it, because of the whole, you know, when your skin gets on the papery material, it makes it white. That's how that whole white button thing starts on all gemmy items, really. It, I mean, it's it's the truth. If, 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 like, one of these buttons had never been pushed by one person, it'd be completely yellow no matter what. Unless, of course, if maybe there were some other things, like maybe with temperature differences, maybe that would cause it. I don't know, but... There is one little thing that I do need to say, though, and that is that there is a bit of a thingy uru down here. You see this is kind of pulled out a little bit, and I'm going to count that as probably a teensy bitsy little problem, you know, but you can't really do much about it. It's just the way the zip tie is, but that does not mean that I'm not going to uh, do anything, say anything to it. So, uh, you, you know, you know, so for the whole rip stains tears thing you know we don't got any stains on them uh, no tears holes but because of that little thing it's gonna have to go to a 9.5 out of 10 but still this is really good for him so yeah next is the working condition so let's just show that when i get older losing my hair many years from now will you still be sending me a valentine So, there's just a little thing there. Now, of course, what a surprise, the gears are splitting. Really, they should be split already, but somehow, they're not. And I've had this guy for over a year. And when I, when I had him a year ago, they were still just as splitty as they are now, and somehow they have not split yet. And trust me, he's been played, well, a lot more than some of the other items. And he's still good somehow. Uh, you know, I don't know how, but... It just happens, and you get lucky. Um, yeah. So, so you know, he's not just, like, a little bit splitting. He's a lot splitting. Like, very noticeable splitting. And that's going to cut it down a lot, okay? That, that's probably going <laughs> to... Well, you know, it's probably going to bring it down to, like, I'm going to say a, a 6 out of 10. Because it not moving is, like, a lot of things, but... You know, it really close to not moving, you know, since it's really badly splitting, it's going to bring it down somewhat still. And I think a 6 out of 10 is just fair. Now, the thing of why it doesn't go even lower, really, is because there are some good things about this. He might be splitting, but his head actually moves really fluidly, and so do his arms. And because of that, it's going to bring it up a little bit. But also, just because of how he's been able to hold up for this time... I was also going to bring it up, so that's really all I need to say for working condition. Um, he's not had any other problems, so nothing else would, you know, go lower. Like, no corrosion or anything on him. Uh, there is on another beagle we're going to be talking about that you'll probably see after this video. Oh, wait, what? Uh, nah, nah, nah. But yeah, uh, working condition, we're just going to say 6 out of 10, okay? Now, finally, for the song. Okay, so that that's enough uh, for the song. Um, this probably would just be like a like a like maybe an average song, maybe a little bit above average. But the thing that actually brings this a bit higher is that it has a high pitch, and I like high pitch when I'm 64 things, Jeremy items. You know, I like it, and I really like that it's the beagle that has the that has the high pitch because I like the frog with the other pitch. Well, I like the frog more of the high pitch, but I think. If it were for the frogs to have the high pitch or the beagle, I want the beagle to have the high pitch. So, yeah. Um, yeah, so really, yeah. I guess the speaker part can go with the song, too. And the speaker, you know, quiet, but I guess it fits in with the song, actually. So, yeah. Um, the speaker is, you know, a bit weird sounding, a bit quiet. I don't know if that's just how this one is or if it's just specifically how this one is or... I don't know. It might be normal with all the when I'm 64 beagles, but, uh, yeah, I don't know why I'm doing that, but, you know, this song with the high pitch, I like it more, so I'm probably going to have to go with a, probably a 7 out of 10 for the song. Yeah, you know, 
maybe like 7.5, but with this whole speaker thing, just a 7. So, yeah, I think that's what it's going to be. So, let's see, everybody. We have a 10 out of 10 for the overall looks. We have a 9.5 out of 10 for the rip stains tears thing. We have a 6 out of 10 for the working condition. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then we have a wonderful, wonderful 7 out of 10 for the song. So with that all together, let's see. What are we going to bring this down to? Let me see. I'm thinking about it. Let me think about it. I really need to think about this for a little. Everybody ready? Okay. 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10, there you go. And, you know, that's just because, you know, some of the things with the working condition and song have to bring down those, you know, have to fight with those, with that 10 out of 10, 9.5 out of 10. It just averages to an 8, I think, you know, with my scoring there. So, there you go. That's what I'm going to say. An 8 out of 10. Good job, you're a good beagle, beagle mania. Yeah, okay, peace.